many of you are reading our classes and we focus on the steps. But the thing that we have not had time, and we find we never have time, and that's why we're doing these student appreciation seminars, is to take a seed of an idea so that then you can take it back into the step patterns that we've done or the practices that will start opening your mind. Okay? When we bring it together to explore this theme and follow the concept, we're still going to be primarily using a palm to palm hold. Okay? Many of you in salsa and also in rumba, where you used to hold and hold, but for lean and follow, and this transfers of energy and some concepts that I want to explain to you when we do hold and hold, you'll be primarily palm to palm. Okay? Those of you in salsa as well as rumba, you've got your closed hold, where we are perfectly in front of each other, where the lady's left palm is above um, the man's shoulder, but we are completely parallel to each other. Okay? Some of you in our ballroom class will soon be doing cha-cha and rumba. You're going to be ahead with this, okay? And then in the ballroom class, we go offset, and there's a certain symmetry to what we do. And we want to talk about how we achieve the lead and follow through these three basic shapes. I'm going to say five, six, seven, eight, and jump in here and go, shh, and go back, and then come back towards it, okay? Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and five again. Four, we know the right knees so that follows. Five, six, seven, eight, and eight. All right, flip. Try to maintain the distance and this equidistance. 